Slide 1, title slide, Good morning, afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. Today, I am delighted to discuss an important health concern affecting millions globally, pneumonia. Our presentation will delve into the intricate details of this lung infection, exploring its causes, symptoms, and diverse treatment options. Pneumonia is a formidable respiratory infection characterized by inflammation in the air sacs of the lungs. This inflammation compromises the lung's ability to function efficiently, causing significant discomfort and health complications. Throughout our discussion, we'll examine the various facets of this condition to understand its impact better. The image before you showcases a stark contrast between a healthy lung and a lung afflicted by pneumonia, providing us with a visual representation of the effects this infection has on our respiratory system. Slide 2. What is pneumonia? To comprehend pneumonia fully, it's vital to acknowledge its multifaceted nature. Pneumonia is not merely a singular illness, it encompasses a range of lung infections, typically instigated by bacteria, viruses, fungi, or the inhalation of irritants. These causative agents infiltrate the lungs, leading to inflammation in the air sacs and obstructing normal breathing function. Considerable diversity exists in the ways pneumonia manifests, from mild to severe cases. This infection poses a significant threat to vulnerable populations, including young children, the elderly, and individuals with compromised immune systems. Understanding the intricacies of pneumonia is crucial for prompt identification and effective management. The accompanying visual aids on this slide display a comprehensive diagram illustrating the affected areas within the lungs during pneumonia. Additionally, it provides a comparative view of a healthy lung alongside a lung afflicted with this infection, facilitating a clearer grasp of its impact. Slide 3. Symptoms and Complications Pneumonia manifests through a spectrum of distressing symptoms. These include a persistent cough accompanied by phlegm or pus, high fever often accompanied by chills and sweating, breathing difficulties causing shortness of breath, chest pain when coughing or breathing, and accompanying fatigue with muscle aches. Recognizing these indicators is pivotal for timely intervention and effective treatment. Moreover, beyond the observable symptoms, pneumonia harbors potentially grave complications. These complications range from respiratory failure due to compromised lung function to the formation of lung abscesses, and in severe cases, it can lead to septic shock. Awareness of both the symptoms and potential complications is essential for comprehensive management. The visual aids accompanying this slide highlight a graphic representation of the varied symptoms of pneumonia. Additionally, an infographic details the potential complications associated with this condition, emphasizing the importance of early detection and intervention to prevent severe outcomes. Slide 4. Diagnosis and Treatment Diagnosing pneumonia necessitates a comprehensive evaluation encompassing physical examinations, chest x-rays, blood tests, and analysis of sputum samples. These diagnostic procedures aid in precisely identifying the specific cause and severity of the infection, guiding the subsequent treatment plan. Treatment strategies for pneumonia vary depending on the causative agent. Bacterial pneumonia often necessitates antibiotics, while viral or fungal types require distinct antiviral or antifungal medications, respectively. Alongside pharmaceutical interventions, adequate rest, hydration, and symptom management constitute crucial components of treatment. Severe cases may necessitate hospitalization to ensure intensive care and monitoring. This slide features a visual representation, such as a diagnostic flowchart and an overview of treatment options available for managing pneumonia. These visuals elucidate the step-by-step -step diagnostic process and highlight the diversity in treatment modalities based on the infection's underlying cause. 